So I'm here with Jessica from Holistica. And uh, first of all, Jessica, congratulations on your award. Thank you so much. And uh, can you just uh, start us off by telling us what Holistica is all about? Yep. So my background is dance and focusing on body posture. Mm -hmm. And throughout the decades of working in the um, holistic therapy industry, um, I've become more and more aware that people generally don't understand their body. Okay. So they're feeling a little bit lethargic, a little bit miffed off. Um, but not understanding that what they're bringing in from external world into their internal world um, is then projected back out again. Um, very simple process of aligning and balancing the internal body energy can have a huge impact on communities, families and own um, happiness, ultimately. Okay, and exploring your energy, as it were, and um, uh, and raising those sort of levels mm -hmm. can be done in numerous ways, and you, there's a number of ways in which you, you help people. Yeah. yeah, yeah, focusing on body posture. So um, I'll just do a quick uh, introduction to my book. There we go, yeah. <laughs> uh, number one best-selling book um, on Amazon available. The way you move says it all, and it goes through all different areas of the body, your three main curves in the spine, but your five areas, um, and allowing that energy to shine, a shen shine. And uh, you've got your own facility as well, because you do work one-on-one -on -one with people and, uh, and in groups as well. Can you tell us more about the sort of services that you offer there? Yeah, of course. So at Ponderosa in Heckmondwijk, I run workshops uh, for communities to come in um, and have a relaxing retreat afternoon uh, where we focus on switching off the mind. Mm -hmm. I don't like to say mindfulness because it's actually mindless. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> so... Just re relieve it, take something out of it. Yeah, Correct, in, exactly, yeah. yeah. Just completely relaxed decompress um, and feel okay to do that because I feel a lot or I find speaking to people um, a lot of the times people don't allow themselves to switch off mm. don't know how to switch off and don't understand why it's important to switch off so I run workshops at Ponderosa in Heckmondwijk I also um, open up to CPD workshops mm -hmm. for um, corporate events and that's focusing on Indian head massage and also arm and hand massage so for example if you notice a colleague is feeling a bit stressed yeah. or maybe a little bit uh, tetchy uh, <laughs> you would In understand that <laughs> world, that's yeah. right yeah um just understanding how to allow them to melt yeah. within 10 minutes just from a simple head massage or hand massage human touch is so important mm. um and so it's focusing on, on on allowing people to feel okay with that yeah, and uh, you're actually looking towards the sort of next generation, aren't you, and yes. helping them understand our bodies a bit more. That's Tell right. us a little bit yeah. more about that. Yeah, lovely. Um, so, years ago when I started in the holistic therapy world, yeah. um, I always said we should be taught this in school. Okay. And I've been on my high horse about it for a long time, and I finally thought I need to do something about it. Not that I'm expecting to change the world, but I think if I put a a step forward, um, I might be able to do make a difference. So I got my teaching qualification and I work as a supply teacher so I can get the credibility to say I understand the national curriculum, I understand children, this is my wellness workshop that I want to take into schools. Um, children are so receptive to body energy, uh, they they have it in them to, to understand it's when we become an adult that we switch mm, off. Yeah. Um, and so I think leading it forward from the younger generation yeah. as they grow up they'll become much happier they'll yeah. become much more aware mm -hmm. of their bodies and ultimately big statement i know <laughs> but it might make a difference on the nhs it might make okay. a difference on health yeah so just understanding the body can have a huge impact and um, just finally, going back to the start, you were talking about posture, and I'm sure this is probably referenced in your in your book as well. But what sort of parts of the body does that all? I mean, does it start from the feet? Is it really a ground up uh, yeah. feel in terms of uh, where people should be aware from and, and start yeah. making those corrections? Absolutely, the feet are the foundation of the body, so they're a footprint, so to speak. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the way that we hold ourselves ultimately comes from the pelvis, ultimately comes from the shoulders and the base mm. of the skull. So if we focus on those three, yeah, <laughs> but honestly, just pulling up tall, that energy then shines. Yeah. 
And you feel brilliant. So <laughs> <laughs> you do though, don't you? Yeah, no, you do, yeah. Okay, well, congratulations thanks on your so awards. Much. And uh, thanks for taking the time to speak to us brilliant. today. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.